Welcome to another Ergon Review. It's Manny with you today. And we're going to be talking about a little bit of this air rifle. Look at this. Crawl Puncher Breaker Marine. This is a beauty. Look at, look at this, baby. I'll be with you in a minute. Is here Crow Marine Puncher Breaker. Awesome. For the price of this rifle, which is $550 on Amazon, came out to me from these people of wholesale surplus. These people is there in Atlanta, Georgia, and they're on Amazon. They have all you need for the price that you want. So Let's talk about this rifle. Synthetic. They come in woodstock. Right here. Smart cocking action. How short a barrel. Look at this. I don't see it in any video out there yet. You can remove your suppressor. And you probably can screw in another fancy suppressor or probably your muzzle breaker or you can probably make something different for your rifle. But this is really good things, guys. Starting good. Your tank. Your tank is 280 cc's. All you need to do, you move this part right here. Insert your fill probe. And you're ready to go. Hand pump friendly, backyard friendly, and has well two rotary magazines. Ta da! Something that is really nice and I really love it. Because these rotary magazines, you can fit in these rotary magazine 12 rounds. In a 77, I believe you can put around 14 rounds and a 10 in a 25 caliber so guys this is something else up here picatinny rail down here this rifle have power adjustment screw you can adjust your your power that's great for this price one thing from this rifle is not regulated. It's not regulated rifle. But have all those features that you need. And it's pretty accurate. It's just amazing. And have those features, you know, slide. Right here, your trigger. Is this smooth? It's adjustable. Your cocking system. It's a smooth too. Your cheek pad go back and forward, which is good. I like it. And I mean, for the price, wow. So let's talk about the wooden ones. Wooden ones, they are all wood. They look really nice. I choose synthetic stock. Because I like more synthetic stock. But this is one thing that I like from synthetic stock. And the wood ones don't have this. Right here. This compartment. You open it. And you put your extra magazine. Close it. Voila. You can take it anywhere. So guys. This is a great rifle. Alright guys, now let's talk about accuracy and this rifle. This rifle improved well with all of those pellets that you got out there, those the ones that you can find in Walmart. And I'm gonna tell you something right now. You're gonna be surprised. So let's start with this. Got those Gamo TS 
22. This is a grouping that I have with the Gamo TS-22. It's not that good. The next grouping that I'm going to show you right here is the RWS Superdome and 14.5 grain. And this one is right here. Those improve pretty well, you know. If I put my finger right here, you probably can't cover most of the chat. I got one, two, three in the same hole and a flyer right here. So you can put that one on the list if you buy your rifle. Next groupings that I have over here, right here, that is a group that I have. With a Crossman Piranha, let me show you which ones they are. I know you probably see them everywhere. 22 caliber, 14.3. There, right there, is five shots out of it, and it's a group grouping. Just to let you know, I'm shooting my rifle on 29 yards, and it's out outside. Uh, this morning I have winds from 7 to 10 miles per hour and you know this rifle improved well. All of these from here is from those pellets from Daisy. I don't want to I don't want to even even talk about this. So you can see all of those they're everywhere. I try to stack one of them in the same hole right here. It's not going to work. Uh, this one right here is a Gamma Magnum Energy, this kind right here. So this is a group that I have right here. You can see it. One, two, three. I don't even waste my time with them because they're good, but they don't improve very well on this rifle. You want something accurate. So next group in that I have over here is a Gamma Rockets. This kind, they are like a hundred and a tenth. I'm not even sure how many grains they are right now, but it's a one, two, three, about four shots in the same hole almost. Those are another ones that you can put on your list for this rifle. And this right here is one of those, I believe, Gamma Red Fire or Red Flight, the ones with the plastic. Those improve well, but you got one, two, three holes in it. And the last ones that I have right here, just to let you know, I love JSB pellets, but in this rifle, this is what I get from those. JSB pellet Jumbo Monster 25.4 grains right here. This is the groups that I have. This is one, two, three shots, four, five, and six. So they're not grouping really well in this rifle. And down here, I have a Crossman Domet Ultra Magnum. Those make a good groups, but they're not that, you know, that tag is one, two, three, and the flyer, four. But, believe it or not, the one that really surprised me is one of those cheap ones. I hear a lot of stuff from those pellets. This group right here. Those are six shots, same hole. Guess what? Hollow Point, Premier, Crossman, 14.3. Believe it or not, they're cheap and they're right there. Same hole. All of those in the same hole. Same times. They improve pretty well. That's why I put the winner. And, guys, just remember this. It's not the name, it's not the brand. It's which one improved better for your rifle? And keep it in mind, you're going to hear a lot of things about JSB, 
uh, H&M, and a lot, of, a lot, a lot, a lot of there. And I keep trying, I'm going to keep trying a lot of different palettes from H&M and JSB as well. But the ones that really give me a good chat right now is these ones. So guys, I really recommend, if you guys are going for birds, doves, uh, these palettes, JSB, are expensive. They are really expensive. I think a tenth of... 500 is about seven, 17 something, probably $20, probably $25. I'm not sure right now, but just to let you know, those Premier PowerPoint do the job pretty well. Thanks again for Wholesale Source Surplus in Atlanta. Uh, the guy is Bina. He make awesome job shipping this rifle and guys any question write it down here put it if you like thumbs up if you don't like this video thumbs down if you like it please share it share my my video and have a good one enjoy your rifle and you better shut safe okay thank you